Monica Marissa, we watched Bell, we watched police leaving that area, leaving the scene at Belknap Mall around four o'clock this afternoon, and we know investigators were there responding to reports of shots fired in the parking lot of the mall. Police tell me that officials first responded to this call at around 1:30. When we got there, we saw police condensed to the area of the Jones Fabric Store, but they have not confirmed with us exactly where in the mall parking lot those gunshots were fired. We've been in touch with state police tonight who say they were on scene at the mall assisting with the Bel Belmont Police Department's investigation into all of this. Laconia Police and the local sheriff department were there too. We know police have taken one person into custody at this point. And just a few moments ago, we spoke with the police chief here who says the man they have in custody, left the Joanne's fabrics, went to the parking lot and then into a nearby trail where police found him and took him into custody. Police also say at some point during all of this, he met up with his father, who was being considered a witness at this time, but they couldn't tell us anything else about his involvement. Belmont police say right now there is no threat to the public. At this point, we are still working to learn more about exactly what happened, who was involved and if anyone has been hurt. Coming up at, coming up at six o'clock, we'll have more confirmed information information from Belmont Police. We're live in Belmont tonight. Imani Fleming, WMUR News 9.